Welcome to Foss Video Tour of Six, the Bridal Road, where today we'll be showing you around a rather lovely four bedroom detached family home. As you can see, there's ample off street parking with garage to the uh, side. Uh, access to the garden, to the rear garden via a gate on the left, uh, by with the uh, car. Bridal Road is a very sought after residential road. Down that way, down towards Foxley Lane with the Weber State right in front of you. And back in the other direction, it will take you onto Plough Lane. Like, um, and Highfield Road, High Hill Crest Road, up over that direction. Let's go and have a wander inside. Okay, once you're in the hallway, got the nice big window, runs down towards the kitchen, bit of understairs storage, right, it goes straight through to the front main reception room. You see there's a lovely brick built fireplace with double glazed French doors to the rear garden. As we swing around, you can see there's a bay window, once again double glazed, to the front with nice wooden flooring. Going into the second reception room, strong dining room but currently being used as a music room. You can see there's a lovely, once again, brick built fireplace with a picture rail around the walls. Beautiful big bay window overlooking the rear garden. Once again, lovely wooden flooring. And you can see we're heading over towards the rear now. As we swing through to the kitchen breakfast room, really beautifully presented. I think it's recently been done. So it's modern fitted kitchen with quartz worktops. You've got a uh, built-in dishwasher. It's dual aspect, so you've got, it comes over towards the front there and swings over towards the back. Two Neff ovens, I think one probably a microwave oven. And then you've got the central island, which is a Neff hob with extractor directly above it. As we swing around, you'll see there's a door there to the side access. And we make access, you see here, you've got the by folding doors that lead directly out to a nice little balcony area overlooking the garden, which is really delightful. And you've got the French doors that go over to the side, also to the rear. We'll do the rear garden in a short while. As we pan around, the private kitchen there is a utility room and a downstairs WC right beside. Making our way upstairs, got the four bedrooms. We'll start off straight off to the left hand side. We've got a bedroom with a double, standard double there with double glazed windows. Right beside it, further bedroom. Not a bad size, we've got the rear of the property still again here. Working our way around. Yet another bedroom. Small double one would describe it, I think, would be safe to say. And we're at the front of the building here. And move it, working our way around to the back. That's just an airing cupboard, I don't think there's any need to open that. Family bathroom, beautifully presented again. You've got the bath in the corner here. Large shower cubicle, wash out basin and WC with a heated towel belt. And then you've got the master bedroom. As we swing around, we'll try and find a better angle. We're at the rear of the building here. So you've got lots of fitted wardrobe space and units around. And then you got a little WC ensuite shower room here. That concludes inside. We'll have a little wander outside to the rear garden. Outside in the rear garden, predominantly a southeast garden. We just came through the French doors from the kitchen breakfast room. You can see there's a nice little patio area. Those steps will lead into the reception that goes front to, front to back. Onto the garden, which is a southeast facing garden. 
you got a nice lovely little seating area here in the corner access down the side there which has a tap as well and then you can see looking back at the house with a bit of storage underneath where the balcony is okay that concludes the viewing tour for 65 Road get yourself booked to come and have a look